Hey everybody, welcome back. Uh, this week's review. Um, how was everybody's week? Hope it was a good week. Good week here. Uh, hope everybody's staying safe. I mean, we, we, we joke about this uh, coronavirus, and it's fun to joke about stuff. It makes people smile, and, but stay safe, guys. Wash your hands. Avoid public places whenever you can. You know, sanitize your hands. All that stuff. You know what to do. Keep yourself safe. Uh, again, I said it before, I don't have many subscribers, and I'd hate to lose one or two of you to something as stupid as that. Um, it'll get better. You know, we, we've, as a society, our governments and stuff, we've learned from going way back to the plague, man, that, you know, ain't everybody going to survive, but most of us will. So, I hope I'm one of them, too. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, I hope everybody had a good week. Um, a little somber start with the whole virus thing, but if I didn't mention it, just I had to mention it, you know. So, uh, what did I wear this week? Well, I wore two different Armani Code uh, dupes. And uh, so I want to take a quick little talk about Code before I... It's one of those sense, Jesus, like, 20 years old now, somewhere around there, hard to believe, I know, but, um, it came out in 2004, so, it's 2020, yeah, it's almost, well, 16, 17 years old anyway, and, uh, yeah, hard to believe, eh, I totally sound a Canadian there, eh, buddy, <laughs> hoser, take off, eh, <laughs> no doubt about it. I'm gonna go get some maple syrup. I'll be right back. <laughs> uh, but no, it's, it's hard to believe that it's that old. It just seems like yesterday that it came out. And uh, the thing about it, I loved it when it first came out. I still love the scent. Um, but I find it just a little boring now to wear um, mostly because it's just Tonka bean powdery Tonka bean you know there's there's so many other scents that have come along and this was the first as far as I know at least the first that I'm aware of I'm sure there were others but this is the first one that I know of that was really popular that really popularized that sweet vanilla that overly sweet vanilla and Tonka because it's a sweet scent and to me, and again, I could be wrong, it kind of ushered in that whole air like I was talking about a few times in a couple of my earlier videos. <clears throat> I'm getting so tired of Tonka and Vanilla. That's, you know, just everything seems to dry down at a Tonka and Vanilla, and I think we got this to blame. So... Now, I know the mall was vanilla, head, but it wasn't the same type of vanilla. This is a sweeter, more powdery, sweeter version of vanilla that a lot of clones in the last 15 years have been using. And that's another reason this is kind of, you know, it's almost a one-trick pony. Others have come along and kind of done the whole thing a little differently. Uh, just a few of the flankers, Privé, Absolute. Uh, then you think of a couple other like Versace, both of them, the arrows, the arrows flame. Um, so look over my collection and see. I, there's just tons of them that have done that Tonka base differently and better. Um, but code is definitely worth it. Worth it. Worth it. It's one of those ones. 
say a modern classic, one of those ones everybody should try. Um, it's not that I don't like the smell of it. I do. It's just, you know, it, it's, it's, eh. You know, I smelled it before, I've smelled it done better. Uh, but when it first came out, man, it was, it was the shit. I bought a little bottle because I really didn't have a lot of money at the time. <laughs> and uh, shoppers had their little Christmas sale on. They had little samples of box it of like Armani for like 50 bucks. And they all came with little, uh, th three of them or four of them come with like 25, 30 mil bottles. So, and I loved it. I ran out of it just about a year ago, that little bottle. Um, so it's still relatively fresh in my mind, what the authentic smells like. And I will say something. Let's get into the, what it is first, and then we'll talk about it. So Ronnie Code 2004 Oriental Spicy. Accords are citrus, leather, aromatic, floral, soft, spicy tobacco. Top notes are bergamot and lemon. Mid is star anise, olive blossom, guyac wood. Base is leather, tobacco, and tonka bean. On me, the authentic code was a little more, just a little bit more, uh, uh, oh God, I can't even think of the word. Just a little more, you get a little more out of it, I guess. Like, like the authentic, I did get a bit of the, the lemon and the bergamot, a bit of the star anise, um, didn't get a whole lot of tobacco, but I did get some leather and a shit ton of tonka bean. Um, really didn't get any guy wood or olive blossom. Though I'm not 100% sure what olive blossom smells like, so I don't remember smelling it. So, <laughs> and The Authentic's longevity is pretty much legendary. Right now in the perfume world, most people will tell you it's 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 a it's a ten plus hour performer projects really well. Not quite beast, but almost on most people for two or three solid hours. It's a good cologne. I don't want people to think that I'm trashing it when I at first because it kind of sounded like I it was. It's a beautiful scent. It's a good cologne. It's just been done better. Is what I was guess was I was trying to say by other people now, um, but uh, the authentics pretty much the same smell. The performance not quite as good, not to be expected really though. Um, let's get into the first one, the one that I like uh -huh. least. <sighs> this one's performance is shite, as you can see from the bottle. I wore half of it. Well, that's not fair. I wore probably that much of it in a week. Um, this is by that Mirage company. It's called Magic Code. I'll give you a spray of it. Not the best sprayer as you've seen. Kind of spitzy spurtsy. Um, The scent itself is pretty nice. Like I said, you get that citrus off the top, and then pretty much powdery tonka bean. Um, performance on this one, like I said, not the best. Only got about an hour and a half. Um, projected okay for about literally 10 minutes. Then it just turned, like I said, into a powdery tonka. Almost like a powdery tonka, like a like a like a vanilla body butter. You know what I mean? Just sat in the skin. Nah. The next one is Uptown for Men by Preferred Fragrance. They got to write up preferred. Sometimes has a write up. They do. Uptown is a manly fragrance superior to all the rest. The sharp and refined notes of lemon and bergamot give way to the mysterious dark base of tonka bean, tobacco and leather that she won't be able to resist. Ooh. Shit, right here, guys. Sure, right here. Panty dropper. She won't be able to resist. Uh, 
better spray. I took this off. It pops right off. I don't want to do it because it took me forever to get it back on, but it pops right off. This one kind of the same smell as the other dupe. Um, not quite up to the Armani code. Or just not quite up to Armani code itself, but you know, for three bucks. It's not bad. Um yeah, this one's already starting to fade a little bit. Um this one typical preferred. Got about three or four hours out of it. Projected okay for about an hour. Um, the bergamot and lemon seem to last quite a bit long. Seem to last about as long as this cologne does. And then it hits that tonka bean base. Um, and after that, it's pretty much a slightly leathery, powdery tonka bean on this one. So a little closer to this one. To the, the authentic. Um, yeah, like I said, not, not, not bad for three bucks, you know, three or four hours, project for about an hour. And you can see I didn't have to wear quite as much of it. Still had to reapply because it still does after about an hour kind of sit really close to the skin. Um, which isn't bad in, in a one-on-one -on -one romantic type situation. But, uh, Yeah. That was it. I mean, they're both okay for what they are. I definitely go with the preferred if you can. Um, I haven't found a Mirage. They smell good, uh, the Mirage ones, but I haven't found one yet that lasts more than an hour, hour and a half. Just, I mean, if it's all you can get, and by all means, get it. But go with the preferred. Go with the authentic if you can. I don't think code is that expensive anymore. At least on like dealers and stuff retail I think it's still ridiculous but um, yeah not a bad scent guys honestly like I said I'd really go with the uptown but I prefer it over the magic by Mirage yes this one's destroying that one already <laughs> um, compliment factor definitely high very high um, that being said I didn't get a lot of compliments this week um, a couple couple girls told me I smell it smelled good uh, but that's because a lot of people right now are preoccupied with you know staying alive so <laughs> um, yeah so but it, it's definitely a high compliment factor always has been always will be it's I wouldn't call code even these two knockoffs um i just wouldn't wear it in the summer it's a little too heavy and sweet it's uh it's definitely more of a fall type winter scent um i don't even think i'd wear a coat in the summer just because it's a little a little too much around here like i said our springs are cold so worked out fine might be a little too much in the summer though. It kind of almost give me a headache just thinking about it. Just whoa, that's a lot of powdery sweet vanilla. Gonna wear something sweet. Wear a sweet coconut. So that's it, guys. Let's see what we're doing next week. Um, bring this. All right. I'll find it. I promise. <laughs> I already did Musk Fire, the Dreamer, Avon Musk Storm. So that's what we're doing next week. All right, guys. Again, be safe. Take care of yourself. See a lot of people online complaining. Oh, the stores aren't changing gloves in between customers and this. And that. It's not up to them to make sure you're safe. At the end of the day, the only person who really I'm not going to say cares. I'm sure there's a lot of people that care. But the only person that can really keep yourself safe is you. So quit your bitching about stores not doing what you think they should do and do what you can do. Peace, love, be good to each other.